नमस्कार आर टुडे टॉपिक इज इफेक्ट ऑफ एडिंग अ नॉन वोलेटाइल सल्यूट ऑन वेपर प्रेशर ऑफ लिक्विड एंड दिस लिक्विड इज वोलेटाइल दैट इज सॉल्वेंट सो फर्स्ट व्हाट इज नॉन वोलेटाइल एंड वोलेटाइल वोलेटाइल मींस व्हिच कैन फॉर्म वेपर्स इजीली नॉन वोलेटाइल मींस which cannot form vapor like sugar salt in the heat it cannot form vapor but water that can form vapor on heating or even if we keep the water at room temperature it can form vapors right and you know evaporation is a surface phenomenon so to explain the effect of adding non volatile solute on the vapor pressure we take two containers of the same size and we add solvent pure solvent in first container so when we have pure solvent surface of the solvent is occupied by solvent molecules only and this is covered by a bell type jar same is the case here we cover it and we place the liquid to the same level but now in this case we add solute as well actually it is solution means it has solvent as well as non volatile solute see this whole surface is occupied by the solvent molecules only all are volatile but when we talk about this this is the surface which should be occupied by the solvent molecules but when we add solute and this solute forms a homogeneous mixture with the solvent means solution is homogeneous that means solute is everywhere even on the surface so some of the positions are occupied by the non volatile solute now when few positions are occupied by the non volatile solute what happened in this case all the positions are occupied by the volatile component so vapors formed are more in number but in this case what happened see these are the positions occupied by the volatile component but some positions are occupied by the non volatile component so surface occupied by the volatile component is less than in pure solvent that's why number of vapors above the liquid are less now so the level of the liquid decreasing in level let us take this is decreased to this extent so in this case it is decreased about means decrease in liquid is more in pure solvent than in solution or we can say that vapor pressure of solution containing non volatile solute is less than that of pure solvent because in solution surface occupied by volatile 
component is less than that of pure solvent. So, because surface occupied by the volatile component is less in solution, that's why vapor pressure of solution is always less than that of pure solvent. Which solution? Solution containing non-volatile solute. So, keep in mind, this is the only explanation for this topic. So thank you very much for watching this video. Do like, subscribe and share my channel. God bless you all. Happy learning. And one more thing. As vapor pressure decreases, so vapor pressure and boiling point are inversely related. That's why boiling point is more than pure solvent. Means boiling point of solution containing non-volatile solute is more than the pure solvent right god bless you all